What is a burette? A burette is a piece of laboratory glassware used to deliver variable volumes of solutions while accurately measuring the amount of solution delivered. This piece of glassware is generally used for titration experiments. In this video, we will be showing you the correct way to prepare your burette for your titration experiment. Once the burette has been cleaned, the burette must be rinsed with the chemical solution first before it can be filled. This is done by adding approximately 5 milliliters of the titrant into the burette. The burette is then held down nearly horizontal with an empty or waste beaker under the open portion of the top of the burette. The burette is then rotated to allow the solution to flow over the whole inside surface of the burette and the beaker is there to capture any solution that spills out of the open top end of the burette. The solution is then drained through the tap and this procedure is repeated an additional two more times. After rinsing the burette, it is clamped perpendicular to the bench stand. The funnel is then placed on top of the burette making sure the tap is closed. The solution is poured into the burette using a small beaker up until the burette is filled two to three centimeters above the zero graduation line. Once the burette has been filled, always take the funnel out of the burette and wipe the outer surface of the burette with a paper towel. We recommend that an empty beaker is placed under the tap of the burette while filling the burette. This is just in case the tap is left open before filling the burette. When filling the burette, be careful not to spill the solution on the outside of the burette. If there is a spill, the chemicals must be cleaned up as soon as possible with a paper towel. Open the tap of the burette to let out some of the solution into the empty beaker, allowing the solution to fill the burette tip. The tip must be checked if it contains any air bubbles, as this dead volume will result in an incorrect volume reading during the titration. If there are any bubbles in the burette, there are three methods that can be used to remove any bubbles. The first method is to try to turn the tap on and off quickly, rotating the tap 180 degrees. The second method is to tap on the side of the burette tip while the solution is flowing. The third and final method is by taking the burette off the stand and shaking it up and down slightly while the solution is flowing, making sure no solution is spilt. Once the air bubbles have been removed, the burette is refilled with the solution using the procedure mentioned before. At this point, the burette tap is opened to let the solution run out until the lowest part of the meniscus is level with any graduation mark of the burette between zero and two milliliters. At this point, the burette is ready for titration. If you follow the methods and tips described in this video, you should be able to prepare your burette for titration experiments with ease and efficiency.